。咁講完植物嘅碳水化合物生成代謝啦，咁而家講人類咯，咁以下邊一句嘅陳述咧係正確嘅？咁啊睇翻啦，呢三款糖先啦。如果喺人類嘅身體入面啦，單糖嗱最典型嘅就當然係葡萄糖啦，我哋血糖就係佢啦，係咪？雙糖啦，例如啦麥芽糖啦，我哋消化完啲澱粉質就係麥芽糖嚟噶啦。咁到多糖啦，嗱，其中一款呢，我哋食返嚟嘅就係澱粉質啦嚇，嗱，留意啊，唔好誤會咗啊，我冇講過我身體入面會儲存澱粉質啊，我係話我食咗返嚟咋。第二啦，就係、是、真係我儲存㗎啦，就係佳曲醇啦，就儲存喺個肝臟入面嘅肌肉入面嘅肝糖啦，或者糖原啦。咁呢一條題目啦，又係考返我哋啦，喺人類嘅碳水化合物嘅新陳代謝係如何嘅呢？咁對於糖原呢一個碳水化合物，我哋點樣去儲存啦、轉化同埋利用呢？咁呢啲嘅過程就喺我哋人體當中乜嘢嘅部位去發生呢？咁我哋又嚟咗擊破咯喎！第一個呢，佢就講啦 ，conversion of fat 多糖啊嘛，係咪？例如啦，我食返嚟嘅澱粉質醇或者我食返嚟嘅佳曲醇都得。咁佢就話啦，轉化做 Y，Y 呢係雙糖嚟嘅，例如麥芽糖啦。咁呢個過程呢，就唔係純粹話轉換，其實就係應該講消化。咁消化佢話喎，喺個胃度發生，咁呢句就擺到明係錯咗啦。因為啦，我哋要消化澱粉質又好，消化糖原都好呢，其實都係透過二嘅澱粉酶。咁二嘅澱粉酶喺邊度做嘢㗎？就喺吊啲林十二指腸嗰度做嘢，就唔喺個胃度做嘢嘅。咁第一句就已經錯咗啦。咁既然第一句已經 say goodbye 啦，咁答案自不然係二人三 only 啦。咁咪有啲偷精神啦，搞掂埋佢啦。例如啦，葡萄糖啦，就能夠轉化做 set set 就係多糖，就轉化喺我哋身體入面嘅糖原啦。就呢個轉化嘅過程呢，就喺肝入面發生嘅。呢一句呢。自不然就梗係啱啦，食完一餐飯，消化咗血糖咁高咯，咪將過多嘅葡萄糖就轉化做糖原，咪儲存住佢咯。咁下一次啦，自不然又可以問下咯，哇 ，conversion of s e t 就真係變咩呢？今次變 X 咯喎，係咪啊？變翻做單糖咯喎。咁呢件事呢，就又係喺個 liver 嗰度發生，咁得唔得啊？咁梗係又係可以啦。咁今次佢冇咁問你啫，下次可以咁樣問㗎啦嘛。今年呢一條得幾多人啱啊？得五成人多少少啱咋？咁你話下年會唔會問返啲類似嘅嘢？我就覺得有可能啦。咁你話會點出啊？咪當糖尿病咁樣出咯。過往都玩糖尿病都玩到出神入化㗎啦，係咪？咁所以啦，記緊問下糖尿病呢一科咯喎。去到第三句啦，就係、是、set 咧，就係例如啦，糖原咧就儲存喺肌肉嗰樹嘅，咁呢句咧都係正確嘅，所以啦，第三句咧又係啱啦，咁答案自不然就二贏三咯。咁但係如果佢下次又走去講啦，喂，今次呢個 set 咧，佢講到明啊，佢話係 starch 嚟嘅，嚇佢就話咧啲 starch 咧就喺個肌肉入面，咁自不然又係錯啦，咁所以睇清楚題目做人咯。After we talk about the carbohydrate metabolism in the plants, so now we study the case in human being. So which of the following statements are correct? So let's go through the three types of carbohydrates: monosaccharide, for example, glucose; disaccharide, for example, maltose. After the digestion of the starch, we have the maltose. And for the polysaccharide, for example, we intake. The starch. Now, I'm not saying that we store starch in our body. I say that we intake starch. We eat it. And for the glycogen, we shall really store it in our liver, in our skeletal muscles. So for this question, it's checking us the metabolism of carbohydrates in humans and differentiating between the glycogen storage. Conversion and utilization. We also need to identify the location of the metabolic processes in human body. So let's go through the answer one by one. First of the exam say. So let's go through the answer one by one. First one, conversion of fat. For example, starch of glycogen we intake in our body and then convert it to why? Because convert it to the disaccharide, not the very simple one. So it seems like. The digestion of the starch of the glycogen to maltose. So, which type of enzyme do we need? We need the pancreatic amylase. So the question says that it takes place in the stomach. No, 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 it's wrong, because for the pancreatic amylase, they should work in the duodenum, but not in the stomach. Therefore, first statement is wrong. And once we know that first statement is wrong, we say goodbye to statement one, and the answer will be two and three only. So let's take a look at statement two and three. Conversion of X that means the glucose to Z to the polysaccharide, for example, to glycogen, takes place in the liver. 
surely is correct. After we have a meal, just like we intake the rice, so after digestion and absorption, we have excess glucose. So we should convert it into glycogen for storage. So statement two is correct. So maybe next time it asks you that the conversion of Z, the polysaccharide, just like the glycogen, to X, to the glucose, takes place in the liver is also correct because when our blood glucose level is low, so we need to break down the glycogen, convert them into the glucose and release the glucose into the blood. So you see that is the question about the diabetics. Last year, there were only 52% of students got it correct. So is it possible to ask about these concepts in next year? Surely it's possible. So let's do revision. So and then said, for example, glycogen is present in the muscle. Surely, because glycogen can be stored in the muscle tissue as the energy reserve. So statement three is also correct.